Alright guys, what's up? It's Destructor here, and today, yes, I'm continuing my, uh, Gears of War 2 series on my gaming channel here today. Doing something very good. Good, so, we're gonna have lots of fun. Hopefully you can all can hear me. Let me go check on my Twitch quickly. How's well, you guys been doing? Well, alright. Alright, so we're back on Gears of War 2. We're on part 4. We got Hive. It's just gonna be a little bit of a longer one, I think. I don't know. I haven't fucking played this part of the game for a long, long fucking while. So I don't expect much. I'm just gonna get this out to a couple people. Oh, and we are going to be good. But yeah, we're I'm just here today, just chilling. I don't know. I just had some fucking pizza not long ago. Now let's just keep getting to the campaign will just keep going alrighty we're now getting into the Queen's area after our Long road of hell. Help of my say. That was like very painful. Well, at least I'm God I Dover with. But yeah, now we're here. We're just gonna keep going through. Let's just keep casually exploring while I do my normal shtick. Hey, Marcus. On this Lit great torches. adventure. Definitely seen quite quite the adventure so far. Hmm. Do do do. Mm, boy, that doesn't sound great. But yet again, doesn't really fucking matter. I'll be fine. Oh, what? I'm just gonna check my settings quick. Capture settings. Alright, I'm back. With that many troops on the move, that's gotta be the highway. Well, then let's follow them to where the action is. Wait, Marcus. The old guy said we had to branch off the highway at the dam. Look. We need to stick to the mission. We have no idea if Maria's down here and every- I need to know. You don't have to go with me, all right? Damn it. That's just gonna get us both killed. We need to get into the stronghold and activate the beacon. This is it, Dom. This is everything we've been fighting for. Yeah? Well, Maria's everything I've been fighting for. She's my fucking wife, all right? So you're gonna turn your back on your whole world then? The other gears we fought with? All the people who've died? I'm sorry, Marcus. After what you did for your father, I thought you'd understand. Ah, hell. Dom, wait up. Uh. Follow me. All right. <laughs> 
example of good character development and good interactions. That it's actually believable, that's not, you know, overbearing or cr fucking cringe or anything like that. It's just makes logical sense and now we get to see in the front, in the front of it. Now we're getting into some fancy schmancy shit. All clear. Oh boy. When am I getting into the fucking action? I want to shoot some fucking assholes. Darn it. Go back. Marcus. Oh. Looks like the old guy's Damn. intel was solid. Move up. Huh. That's what they want to do after they, you know, process them. Straight up lobotomy. Hmm. Go figure. Ugh. Great. More water. Let's look for a way across. Oh yeah, this shit. This should do it. That did it. Marcus, that grub's open in the floodgates. Scratch one grub. Nope. Close You're one. not. You're not gonna get to fucking flood it's my punk ass. Not a chance in fucking hell. Well, oh, that was good. Sniper and grenades. Let's go. What's up, Brendan Twitch boys? Yo, spread this around to all your friends you can. Wretches! Uh. Time for some monkey doggies. Eat a dick. Fuck you. I would have probably streamed a few days ago, but I got myself banned on Xbox Live. They told someone to go kill themselves. Because they were playing like a cheapskate in like fucking the WWE games. Like, fuck off. If you weren't playing like a cunt, I wouldn't have to tell you to kill yourself. It doesn't really fucking matter anyway. It's just like, it's some, it's some innocent shit. It's so easy to get banned on Xbox. It's like comedy. But that's one fucking incident. But how's your day been, Brandon? Oh, son of a bitch. Damn, that pizza is so fucking good. Right, let's keep going. Behind the crate! It just doesn't fucking end. They just will not go. Good. Sure it was after your team's victory last night. Oh. Run for it. Stay dead. How did he not die? Well, he's dead now, so I don't fucking care. Got one. 
save some of this assault rifle gotcha. bullets. Headshot. What the fucker? Locust terminals. What is this shit? Jack, can you find a visual match on Maria? So many people. I think he found her. What's that symbol mean? Could be where they're keeping her. Let's look around. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> right, yeah, freaking Brandy Sprint to spread dream around. This part will be out on Wednesday. And we'll continue the series like nothing really ever happened. Which that's a good thing for my case. Marcus, I want to take point on this one. Follow me. Alrighty. God. What a pause. How long have they been taking people like this? I don't know, but we've got to keep moving. If Maria's in one of these things, we got to find her quick. Jesus, please. I mean, we've already seen this earlier from like. Let's it's really dumb. Terminal. Twitch doesn't have tell us if she's save streams here. forever. Yeah, I know. They don't fucking have anything like that. I mean, you could save them, but you have to download them and put them on, like, other sites or some shit. Which I think is stupid. It should be like it's YouTube, where you can have, like, endless stream libraries or whatever. Follow me. But, mm, it's only YouTube. If I remember correctly, I think you can actually do this shit stealthily, but, like... Let's let him pass by. Hey, you can do. All right, yeah. Hey, you can just casually just let them just walk. I don't know how long it takes, but it doesn't really fucking matter. Bill Tom to making his own beer. Oh really? After the uh Bud Light controversy? Which I don't know, I find I fucking cringe. There's another terminal. Let's check it. Shit. That's not it. Go! Jesus Christ, no, 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 no. Careful. <laughs> it's a lot more tense. Follow me. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't know. If Bud Light's controversy now, I just think about it, it's just a waste of fucking time. It's like, who cares? It's fucking beer. Beer tastes like shit anyway. And of all the things, Bud Light, that's apparently that tastes like piss. I mean, I think all alcohol tastes like piss because it's fucking piss ant retards, but. This isn't the right area. Whatever. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Let's see more. Get down! Oh, yeah, I gotta close this. God, I gotta put a fucking link to Nick Adams here. Yeah, what the fuck? The Perman's lot. Oh my god, yeah, the Toronto Maine Police are playing right now. Yeah, 50 followers. Neat. Oh, that's close. Button, Brett, Mashy. It could just kill these guys, but that wouldn't be worth it. That's not the right symbol. Move up. I think we're near the right area. I think this is the area.
Fuck these coastal teams. Yeah, yeah, it's coastal bull. Go fucking do this shit. Well, that should be almost. I think that should be it. Now we're probably gonna finally find it, and then we'll just. I don't know. Follow me. I mean, I do appreciate that fact that you can actually do just some dim something different. In this game, instead of just mindlessly going kill, 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 kill actions, like it lets you breathe. Okay, this should be it. That's it. This must now be we're about area. to commence Start into looking. a fight. There's no way it's gonna let you just go fucking like do nothing. They found us. We got company! Jack, find Maria! We'll hold them off! They should expand a team for Saskatchewan and also fuck Gary Bedman. How much money would that make again? And plus, population of Saskatchewan isn't all that big. It's mostly just a farm. The only place they can probably do it is like Regina. But like, who the fuck wants to go to Regina, dude? I mean, the fact that Winnipeg even still- Oh, fuck, I died. Fucking died. Darn it. The fact that even Winnipeg as a team is still a miracle. Yeah, fuck. Die, yeah, yeah. Double nag. That's it. This must be the area. Start looking. Yeah. We got company! Jack, find okay. We'll Alright, time to get rid of the blood mouth fucking jabron, especially the one on the fucking gun here. Alright. Die, bitch! Make you die? Thank you. Powers and jets. Winnipeg, Arizona, basically the same. Yeah. Winnipeg, the city, at least has like a couple hundred K. How much does the fucking, like, Regina have? It's like the only place you can probably put it in. Fuck off, Vite. Focus on the other enemies. Arizona shouldn't even have a team, period. Like, bruh. So you gotta think about some markets, they may work well on the junior level, they're not gonna work on the pro level, and I just don't think Saskatchewan will have it. Like, you know, it's a nice little province for what it has to offer, but it won't be enough for any team. Arizona shouldn't even be a team, period. They should just relocate to, like, an American team, like Houston or something. Good. Like, I don't know. You need to, like, find the right location for something to make the NHL grow. And while, yeah, you Canada may be happy, it's not going to grow. Um, the only sacrifice exception you make is Quebec. Not because it's, oh, the wheel of the Frenchies. Because, well, Quebec will actually generate some decent revenue. Just because they actually are passionate about hockey. I mean, after all, a lot of the best players of all time are from Quebec. Even though they haven't seen exactly any greatness come from that province in a long, long fucking time. Yet again, Batman likes and wants to have a team in, in fucking Atlanta again. What does that tell you about Gary Batman and his intelligence? Come on. Why do they give these guys shotguns and they're trying to shoot from this far? Alright, well. What the fuck? No. Jack, open it up. 
I can't believe it, Marcus. We finally found her. Well, thanks for retweeting it, by the way. Maria. Maria. Sorry, Maria. <sighs> I tried to I find like you. <laughs> God, I, I did. Oh, yeah, Left 4 Dead 2 review. <laughs> oh, please, no. Maria. God damn it, it's me, Dominic. It's Dominic. Marcus, I, I, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, man. She... No. It's okay. Hmm. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Easy. I love you so much. That's Rob. I'm sorry about Maria, but she's in a better place now. You did what you had to do. I found a way to sneak into Nexus, but if you want to go in guns blazing, I don't blame you. I want to kill them all. Huh. Guess I don't have it. I guess I don't have the fucking part. Hi, porn. I thought I had the DLC. I guess they fucking must have just de delisted or something. I'm surviving. About all I can do. Right, there's supposed to be a part, like if I, it was like, I thought I had this installed. There's supposed to be a part where you can either sneak into the Nexus or like go and guns blazing before you get here. I guess either, I guess the Xbox was just fucking retarded. I guess it didn't fucking register it. A little weird, but I, it's not like it's a much of a difference. It probably would add like what, half an hour or something of playtime, like a little, like a couple minutes. Not really was it like a big deal anyway. Or you can just go in guns blazing. I think we found our locust stronghold. Nexus. Now where do we?
do we find? You're not the wrestling faction. That's on that tower in the middle. It's the closest thing we've seen to a palace. So when should we activate the beacon? When we get in deeper. The cavalry needs solid ground to land on. We got to make sure no lifts land in the emulsion. Come on, let's head towards the palace. <laughs> well, it's time to kill some motherfuckers. Pretty quiet Monday to us, I'm not gonna lie. Probably wasn't the best day to fucking stream, but hey, that's life. At least for everyone else, except for me. I don't fucking do anything. I don't work. At least not yet. I can't wait to leave come back so I can actually work a job. So I don't have to worry about my job getting taken by a fucking Frenchman or some shit. I'm a little busy. Dom, don't. Oh, I'm in a tight spot. I'm dead. Fuck. Damn it. I only sent over a thousand applicants possibly in my life. Lol. Yeah, that sucks. I don't know how it can be like down elsewhere, but like. One corpse down. I don't know, fucking. I don't know how it is that fucking English people can stay in this province. Like, if you're, in, like if you're an English person in Quebec who isn't great at French, why would you stay here? Like, bruh, why the fuck would you stay? The only thing you really would do is fucking leave. Like any other what sane person would do. Like, if you can speak French or whatever, then maybe... Ah, oh, I just... God! No, oh, yeah. Ontario isn't good, but fuck, at least it's more livable than Quebec. Just don't go to Toronto or some shit, or like, Ottawa. Like, don't go to places like that. Just like, if you stay like... Or Hamilton. Her Hamilton's awful. Like, if you just stick to, like, you know, more rural, I don't know, just, like, more small towns, it, I guess Ontario isn't that bad. I still don't, as long as it's not near Quebec, I don't really care about Ontario. Like, to be honest. Double kill. <laughs> Bitch. Alright, well, let's just keep going up. No, I can't. Fuck me. Haha. <laughs> Where the hell do I go then? Oh, yeah, I gotta go this way instead. Headshot. Completely nothing but bits. Goodbye. And now what? The fucking more enemies are gonna show up? Why are you down so low, Dom? Bunch of Theron guards.
You crawl all the way out for me. Nice job, Dom. <laughs> Takes me time. They, they dirt and die, motherfucker. Gonna need to grab some bullets. That's all I need, but I don't know. Fucking cool. Can't wait, I just can't wait to get out of Queef back soon, because I'm not... I don't plan on coming back to Quebec ever when I'm out, man. Like, holy shit. Because Quebec, I don't know, it's just unlivable. Well, at least for my sis. What? Who the hell's that? It's gotta be the queen. God save. Good checkpoint. Gonna use you as a meat shield. Oh hell no. Nah. Shoot that motherfucking mo How are you not dead is my question. Holy, you can take a beating. Man, you really are disgusting, bro. Goodbye. Our species is destined to rule Sierra. Keep fighting, my children. Your queen is with you. Yep, definitely the queen. Yep, sounds like another bitch to die. We all know when you have a queen leading your society, it never goes anywhere, right? It never succeeds. Name me a queen in history that worked. That was a societal issue. Not societal issue, but fucking succeeded. And I can't speak today. Oh goody. Watch it, they're everywhere. Oh god, we gonna use more cover. Grenade. I got them out in the open, come on. Get one. Just got him. Fuck. That would have sucked if I didn't have any cover. That'd be made a fucking sitting duck. Hey, five views. Let's go. That's more like it. The views are coming in, baby. Here come the Reavers. Ah, fuck. Great. <clears throat> Just shoot like a madman. Never mind. Fuck that shit. Oh, thank God that thing's dead. Oh, what? Don't know what that was, but I'll take that as a generous gift. Eat dirt and die, bitch. Ah, great. Thank God there's some cover here. Blinders, man, they're everywhere. Damn, can't wait to shut her up. Huh. Species? Yeah, right. Well, that takes care of those grinders. 
And it gets some ammo. You love to see it. Just do. So much people. People in this world. This place close enough for the beacon? Almost. We need to get a little closer to the palace. They can be stopped. Don't give in. I wonder what happens if I just got squashed by that. Would it just force me to fucking say game over? Or just respawn? Oh yeah! Found a turret. Use this turret to kill people. Let's go. Butcher die. Riley plays blast crops with 20 AF. Well, that's good to know. I have not really seen Riley ever play a video game. Like, I know he has. I think he used that an original Xbox or some shit back in the day. But generally, I don't know, I don't fucking pay attention. Mark Brothers don't do anything anymore. I think they're just, what? Right, he's barely on Facebook or some shit? Like, they're not really social media people anyway. They're just like boomer conservatives stuck in Gen Z bodies. That's their prerogative, and I don't really have a problem with that. Not my fucking concern, like what you really believe in. Just don't really shove your fucking beliefs down to everyone's throats, and I think you'll be alright. Man, these guys will not die, will they? That's shit! That was brutal. <laughs> that was cool, also. <laughs> mm. Smells like a good barbecue. Yeah. Ah, fuck. There are no greater warriors anywhere. We cannot be stopped. Blah, blah, we'll blah. That, we, we cannot be stopped. Blah, blah, blah. Hmm. Oh, that was cool. But just... So, you know, these are like the pissant enemies on like horde mode, yet they're introduced here this late in the game. Like, I don't know why they weren't introduced earlier. Guess fucking is to give some new enemies. We're gonna move up now, let's keep going. Shoot that motherfucker. Don't mind if I do. All right. Let's see. Let's keep moving. Ugh. Nothing can stand before us, my children. We shall conquer the surface. Sweet grenades. That's probably gonna tell me I'm gonna need them soon. Like this, I think this area. I don't know, unless this, unless it looks similar, but like this general area. Like this area, I think you'd be using that if you weren't in like had this game's extra like part of the campaign for this act after like Rhea's death. But I could be wrong. I don't know, I haven't played that in a while. I might play that for footage reasons. Does anyone want to fit every- I guess I couldn't- I couldn't fit everything on the disc. Uh... We're in deep enough. 
Jack. Set off the beacon. Wonder when my fucking bro will give me a little bit left for dead two thumbnail. That was easy. Well, the action has to continue. We gotta buy Jack some time. Hold them off. Get fortified, baby. You gotta get fortified. Kickers, not good. Good mental note case. I need to stay in cover. But yeah, I don't know. Fucking weather down here in Montreal has been getting a little more rainy lately. I don't know. I guess it's a good thing. Kidding me? Not this shit. That's just what I need. More enemies, but still. It's just a rainy, definitely more of a rainy day. Which, I don't know. I guess there's advantages to that. Wow, fucking, you know, Montreal. This is like the sanctuary place. There's like this geese, fucking, whatever they call this fucking thing. I don't know what it is with this fucking thing, but like, it's like on this super aggression. It's like got some problems. Oh dear god, Reaver, Reaver. But like, still, this fucking geese, it, it will like, it will attack you and come near it. I almost got attacked by this thing. I was like, oh. No. Thankfully, it never happened, but still. You know, I was like, oh shit, what is it gonna do? Come on, come on, die. Okay, good, he's down. Fucking crazy, like how these animals can just be fucking so aggressive for no reason. Yeah, and that's just life for you, so I'm not gonna fucking complain. Enemy reinforcements! Reaver is gonna come now. By the gate, there you go. Oh, Jack got Just the doesn't off. fucking end. Motherfuckers keep coming, like holy shit. What the oh, it's a mortar, no. Oh, hell no. Nah. Mortar. Sweet. This might be use. Uh. Save me the time. Watch it, Quan. All right. Coming in. All right. The beacon worked. All right, let's just shoot that bitch, and we can continue the progress. Oh no, no! Yeah, all right. Well, fuck it. I'm not gonna use this thing much longer anyway. Let's give you a little nice cut and slice, eh? Kick ass. To go. Oh, fuck my life. Does it get any worse, eh? Oh, uh, fuck. I don't know when I'm gonna do part fucking. That's a five. Part five of this probably should be sometime next week or later on the weekend. Died. Fuck my old. Fuck man, that was crazy. More grind lifts. Oh goody. Gonna have more of an assault. Who they're messing with? 
Blah, blah. We don't care, Queen. I'm shut up, bitch. Die. Alright, well, they should probably take care of him. This black mortar. Let's just waste this because we want to be cocky. Yeah. Alright, that's good. Switch it up, baby. Ugh, oh, fuck them. There we go. Fucking video I released earlier today, at least, well, Monday, was the fucking, uh, what was that video? Welcome yeah, the saddest YouTube channel. The world, baby. Wouldn't want to be anywhere else. I think I take the tropical island. So now what? Now we gotta get into the palace. Find that queen. Let's move, Delta. Alrighty, we got, got more backup. This should be good. Now we're getting to the fun. If that's the palace, I'm guessing this will lead us to it. Worth a shot, man. Oh, fuck. I have no turning back. Oh, Woody. Getting closer and closer to the end. Yeah, fucking that, that's some Trudeau shit. Like, I don't still can't believe that guy still has his own YouTube mm -hmm. channel. How the fuck does he have his fucking channel? Don't get how they could have built all this shit so fast. And funny thing is, it, it's mostly just all hate comments. Anyone is genuinely a fan. There isn't much good viewer. Did and I just see? Emotion. Are they thriving? I must have saw a computer. Maybe. But that queen of theirs keeps talking about reaching the surface. On the surface of Sierra, we shall find our Yeah, that's that's what I thought. I was like, what the fuck? Reavers! Oh no. No Lucas. shit! Shoot them down before they knock us off the cable! Who's next? Well, well, shit, this is going to be a little tense. All right, well, they screwed up. Come on. There they are. Yeah, fucking Trudeau. Like, I love how most of the people, I, I'm surprised he actually let his fucking comments out. I guess he's trying to show he's got some balls in him. I doubt it though. Because, you know, he doesn't have any balls. I wish Sony bought Nintendo so we can have Super Smash Bros. on there. Yeah. I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> okay. Get up the fucking grind cables already. I am nervous that this shit's going to crack in the next shot or two. Goody, I think I made it through. Grenade! Fuck you! Oh my god, dude, this one keeps calm. Come. Oh man, we go. Nope, here we go again. Oh boy, that's a long way down, ain't it? Almost there. Keep out of Delta. Enemy reinforcement. Great, this just doesn't fucking end. Shit. 
Thank God it's over. Sorry, I got my first try. Holy shit. Anyway, yeah, I don't fuck it. If Sony bought Nintendo and they had their crossover, holy shit, man. Microsoft wouldn't stand a chance. But thankfully, that never happened. I don't even think they would work out just because they want to do things way differently. Just tell how they operate. The hell? Why the hell are they in such a hurry? Looks like we must be kicking some serious ass. I don't think it's us. Too far from the beacon. Must be something else going on. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, we can see that. All right, another person. Welcome to all the viewers that are here. Hope you're enjoying this as much as I am. Yep. I don't know, just having a great chill day. Oh, what's this? You're gonna be a fucking collectible? Are they fighting each other? What the hell? Huh. <laughs> They're fighting each other. Hey, can I get the... Oh, I can't fucking get it? This war. Whatever, not a big deal. Hank kills gas. Bobby. Bobby who? Hey, right, throw a grenade. <laughs> well, that was just gonna end badly. It's even so bad, some of the fucking body parts are just flying up there. It's not like it was supposed to happen. They were rolling stones on the wall, going to the bathroom. Nah, I don't have one. First and second period, third period. Oh, dude, stop. Not Bobby Hill. Some other guy. I mean, he's not even related to Bobby Hill. Who has just said himself that it was Bobby Hill outright? At least as I remember, I haven't seen him in a while, so it's good to see you, Hank Hill Gas. Uh, Dom, here go Troy. Bear, take the left. Cole and I got the right. Yeah, that, that's exactly. That's how we. That's how the guy operates these days, Bobby. They were big four metal band. Are you talking about like the thrash guys, like the big four, like in the you know the Metallicas and you know, Anthrax, make it as the Slayers? Are you talking about that or just in general? Oh, you're talking about the thrash stuff. Oh, but easy, it's make it as make it as the best out of the big four. Like we're just talking about that. It's like make it as. What is it? Fucking Negative's number one. Fucking what is it? Anthrax is two, Metallica's three, and Slayer's four. They're all good bands and all, but like some are better than others. Well, I mean, I don't know. I guess it just likes fucking old ass like rock and roll music. What else is there to say? Nothing wrong with that, so I'm not gonna judge them. Some people are just different. They're old souls. I mean, that's how it is. I'm an old soul fucker. Most of the shit I love is from the 80s. Eh, back in the day, yeah, but not anymore. Slayer's so pretty, like, tamed and loved by everyone. They're pretty, I mean, Slayer's edgy, but I don't want to call them scary. It's the 
I mean, that would be nice, but I don't think da at this point, I don't think hair is really a concern not if you're Dave Mustaine. I think Dave Mustaine's more concerned about if he can actually keep his throat alive. Not much a cut much of a dying color. I don't know, it's Dave Mustaine. It doesn't matter what he can do anyway. He can be on Joe Rogan and just do whatever the fuck he wants. When you're old as fuck, dude, hair doesn't matter. Exactly. Why the fuck would you care about hair? I don't even give a shit about my hair. Like, fuck, if I went bald, I would not be against that, but... Unfortunately, that ain't the case. Your thoughts on the Mexican guy in Metallica? You mean Robert's your hero? He's a good bass player, he's just not being fucking utilized in Metallica. As a lot of the cases. Best days are in suicidal tendencies and infectious groups. There it actually shows you can actually be a fucking good bass player. Too bad he doesn't carry that same ferocity and you know, skill. Looks like Roman Reigns though, I'm not gonna lie. A little streetland skulls. Find a way to drop their cover. Die. He's almost forgotten Metallica member while he's in his band for twenty plus years. Well, he's only done like what three albums in that span, and he hasn't really contributed much. Like Otto from Simpson says, Metallica rules. Lol. Yeah, hippie. Well, no shit. I mean, after you like make an album like Master of Puppets, you're gonna just go down, down, downhill. And they learned that the hard way. Started out with justice, and well, I think the rest is history. All right, there you go. Wanted to piss off hardcore Metallica fans. Say they're never seen with a cliff. <laughs> How would that piss them off? I don't know. What would happen if if James to take the test? Or his voice got deeper. Would Metallica got better? Get better? I don't think it's the vocals that's gonna make a difference. I don't know what to tell you, ain't kill gas. I just it don't matter. I mean, James keeps getting fucking old. He used to have that snarl to him, but that's been gone away. Oh well. Oh God. That's nasty. Yo, Dom, don't touch that shit. You could get rust lung off that or something. I don't know, man. It, it looks infected. Yeah. Good call. Let me get this shit straight. The regular locusts are fighting the glowing locusts? I thought they were all on the same side. I was wondering why we were doing so well. Well, that explains their desperation in the raids. They're losing their home turf to the Lambent. Well, he's old, that's why. You get older, you lose your vocal cards. It doesn't matter, like, fucking, it doesn't matter what you can do. Unless you just got that natural vocals, you're not, there's nothing you can do. Like, again, unless you're fucking Rob Halford or some shit, then you can maybe get away with it. But even then, those are just rarities. Oh, jeez. Almost died there, thank God. Die. Oh, nice. Didn't my... 
He hasn't exactly had the deepest voice in a long time, ever since fucking... I guess ever since Death Magnetic, really, it started to get softer. Even beforehand, it was starting to not be that fucking, like, harsh with the vocals. Good thing, too. I have a feeling we wouldn't have lasted this long without some help. Behind you! Chuck's dead, bro. I don't know. They should just fucking quit. If I was Metallica, I'd just quit, but... I can't tell them what the... Oh, that's some humor shit. I guess you've been around Metallica, man. Okay. Dame Stan is gay for Lars. He sure loves shit talking him. Which I don't blame him. But, you know, Lars Orr sucks! Lars is gay. James is gay. And the. Oh, hold on. Lars is gay. James is gay. Kirk's a queer. And Jason likes dick. <laughs> Now this, now the BOP shows on. Forgot about. I forgot I even follow that shit. That doesn't fucking matter anyway. All right, keep the chat going. Here comes some more. Take cover. Oh no, you don't. I just, I did. Damn, I just got cooked. In Canada, why do you guys like Rush? They suck. Well, I guess to most people, Rush makes good music and are technical and yada yada yada. I don't even like them that much personally, but like, they're better than a lot of the crap that Canada puts out. Here comes some more! Take cover! I mean, to an extent, it's probably like over exaggerated, but I think there's like truth to it. At least more so in the Lars' this fucking front. Like, I think some of that shit's, like, exaggerated. Yeah, when he calls himself, like, um, the, I was the alpha male of, like, Metallica and shit. Like, you know, he was, like, choking and dumb shit like that. But, like, the royalties, you know, like, that's genuine. Like, come on, like, especially with the, all those old EPs that they wanted to just reissue. But Davis, like, having none of that. So I can't exactly blame Dave, it just depends on what it is. Yo, those glory ass locusts are coming. I'm on it. Got him. Are you seeing this shit? Yeah. Fortunate. They're all bulky. Most of these characters are all bulky as shit, my dude. They're like exaggerately on steroids. Well, I wouldn't say they're on steroids exactly, but they're over exaggerated toward like not, not even steroids. We can let them make look steroid people look small. Like they over exaggerate. It's like fucking. They look like Hulk characters. End of the line, folks. Oh, this bitch's house is creepy. This is it, Delta. Pull this off, and we end the war. 
Oh, facts, Tree Land Skulls. They're great characters. Great flood. Huh. Very religious. Stay alert for traps. They're not gonna give up the palace easily. What is the newest battle band you like? <sighs> newest? I'm trying to think. We're talking just by how they came out recently? I don't know. The windows. Oh, that's just great. Oh, uh, I don't fucking know. I don't look from Spotify. I mean, I'm getting into some new bands and shit, but they're only exactly new bands. Who the hell's got me on my cover? Ain't no way we're getting in this. Guards. Marcus, we need to fall back. Nice. Jesus fucking cr Skull fuss? But skull fist? What kind of band is that? Next. I think that like the last newer band, I don't know. I can't think of by recent by when they came out. It's all older shit. I mean like I've went through like in flames, fucking been getting into some pennywise lately. Fuck, like uh just in whatever bands that I can find, really, like especially like Burnout Paradise, I found two new bands. And yeah, forgot what they were. I gotta get back to listening to them later tonight. Like, shit like that. Fuck. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to expand. Fuck. I'm trying to get. Maybe we'll get into like nuclear assault and shit. Never listen to Pearl Jam. How is it? I think they suck. But however, I know VWE likes them, and I think a lot of people like them. If you like Soundgarden and shit, Nirvana and all that crap. You probably like it, but personally, I think it's crap because I hate grunge because it's for fucking hippies. There you go. I don't know who the metal YouTuber is. I'm assuming it's Metal Trenches, maybe. I don't fucking know. They didn't turn to metalcore. They turned into like fucking alt metal butt rock. They haven't never made a metalcore album in their lives. Oh no. Ugh. I don't blame you. They exactly have made a good album in like 17 years. Until I will say the new album, they have redeemed themselves. It's not perfect. It still has some of the cringe elements that they've carried after like post come clarity, but it's a welcome step in the right direction. I'm in my own. Thoughts on Demon Hunter. Never really listened to any of their work, but I know Jared Genesis, the, the fat potato head I roasted like you know not too long ago, has liked them. So probably not a really good in sign. Don? They're a Christian metal core band? I thought there was some alt metal band or some shit. I know they're Christian, but I don't know. I don't listen to that shit. It just sounds corny. Let's use it! I probably wouldn't like Demon Hunter anyway, so like fucking, I'm not gonna we? lie. It doesn't well, sound like music would I would just be like personally gross. invested into. At the bottom. Like I like some melodies, but I need something much more stronger than just basic mel. Do you like the All Remains guy? Oh, you mean Phil Labonte? I mean All That Remains? I mean they haven't made a good album since 2008, but you know, oh, 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 Phil seems like a pretty cool person, I guess. I mean, what did you expect, bro? I mean, 
Pearl James fans that are like Gen X or fucking nineties kids. Are you Gen X kids that were like young adults during the nineties or the windows, I think this place they're fucking like you know nineties kids. Dom, you and Bear take the left. Cole and I got the right. Let's see if we can find a way down to the Queen's chamber. Like I don't know what to fucking say. Unless Let's you're do it, Or unless you're just like fucking rock and roll bullshit, so I don't know. But it doesn't really matter either way, it's like fucking what you're getting is like me. Okay, I gotta kill the smaller. I at least I have something to do while I <laughs> while I play this fucking game. Who's next? Uh snobbish fan base. You know which band has a really snobbish fan base? Tool. Do you like any singers or bands that are not rock and metal? Uh, I'm trying to think. Fuck, what's with my dad? Fuck. You know, coughing like a motherfucker. Radio, oh. Yeah, fuck Radiohead. Fucking garbage ass band with a retarded fan base. Ah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to think. What are things that like outside of rock and metal? I guess, again, I kind of like Tom McDonald, the, the rapper. I mean, even then, I don't like him as much as I used to. I think fucking, uh. I don't know. Oh, man, this shit's getting stale, but I like some of his songs. I don't, I don't listen to shit that's outside rock and metal, really. Oh, here's an Easter egg, by the way. Chipper, ain't she? You like Steel Panthers? Nah, I'm good. <laughs> Not into that cheesy hair metal crap. Who wants toast? I like them crispy. I like them crispy on the outside. <laughs> I never knew that shit was in the game until I just looked it up randomly on YouTube. I was like, what's this? Jesus Christ, Father. But yes. Alright. I mean, Steel Panther is literally just a parody band, for fuck's sake. They're just a dumb parody band of, like, glam metal. Which is in itself rat- Well, uh... Hold on, what the hell's going on? My battery's just. Alright, testing, testing, okay, I'm... 
I'm back. Uh, my ba I guess my batteries were low. I didn't realize it because they would just keep fucking going on and off. So that's good. So we are... We're on some good news. Now we can get back to just killing motherfuckers. Think so. Just keep hustling. I was wondering what was going on. Yeah, Steel Panther, like, I don't know. I don't know what I said about them, but, like, they're just a dumb parody band. After we get through here, I'm gonna take a small piss break. Oh, God, I bet the girl was a fucking geek. Like, oh, Tool's a good band, but fuck, dude, their fans suck. They're like fucking dumbass losers. Give me that. I don't know which band's worse, Tool or Dream Theater fans. The Perfect Circle is trash. I've never listened to a Perfect Circle. I've only listened to like Judith, and I'm like, well, oh, it's a cool sounding song, but it doesn't really blow me away. Oh yeah, and their god awful cover of a shit song in Imagine. Scratch one that song is trash. But yet again, the original song in question is just crap. Like fuck Imagine. Imagine all the people like. Imagine, like, fuck John Lennon. Oh, a gym girl, woo. Oh boy. Is there any conservative metal songs? There's conservative metal people. Dave Mustaine's one. I know Kid Rock's one, but Kid Rock sucks. Oh, I'm dead. Imagine me getting shot. Oh, ooh, sound like a skill issue. I guess so, little bro. Just do communist street lance skulls. It is gay. I don't really care about how the music sounds. I mean, I just don't like the Beatles in general. But like John Lennon's, like, oh my God, the what he, this shit he's on about. It's just imagine, like, bro, a working class hero. Like, bro, the reason why John Lennon will suck is always because he's a communist. Communism's bad. Yeah, Kid Rock is just for dumb rednecks who want to fuck their sister. Oh. Alrighty. This is yeah, well, that's to be expected when you have a band that's lasted as long as them. And they're like, oh, we've done so much. Fucking, just fuck off. Now, alright. We're we'll right back. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna take a fucking piss break.
Oh, oh fuck, I'm back. Alright, I can't get extra viewer all is gone. Taking a piss break. Huh, who would have thought? Alright, we'll just keep those comments going. Ted Nugent, he's Ted. Uh, he's not really the first American metal guy. I don't know. Even in, his, he's more of a hard rock guy. Yeah, that guy is a fucking proud conservative. <laughs> Check this out. Looks like a libertarian. The about. So we know they're trying to sink Jacinto. It sounds like it'll flood the hollow. Why would they do that? They're desperate. All this time, we never realized that. Jack, plug in and see what you can find. We cannot allow the Lambert to pollute the surface. We must bury their infection here. Fuck Oasis, they're overrated, man. Fuck the Brit pop up. Queen. Not you, her. You were great. I loved your, your speech there, especially with the bitch ass stuff. Very good, very enlightening. Jack, anything? There appears to be only one way to end this war. I fear the cost may be too great. Marcus, is that who I think it is? I think so. If we were to sink Jacinto. It would flood the hollow with seawater. Nothing below would survive. We could end the war today. But only if we sacrifice our last possible refuge. Who's that talking? Adam Phoenix. He's my father. What? But what's he doing in the Locust computers? We'll figure that out later. Look, my father and the Locust Queen are saying the same thing. It's just a matter of timing. We need to sink Jacinto before the Locusts leave, not after. Can we even do that? Marcus, I know it's your dad and all, but listen to what you're saying. Consider it a backup plan if we can't get to the Queen. Jack, see if you can send the data back to command. Tell him we found another way to put the Locust down for good. Keep moving, Delta. Oh. Now that's what I call a great speech on Cole's part. Just so enlightened. Straight to the point. It's just wonderful. Anyway. The problem is, like, just because an artist is covered... Like, just because your know, songs are covered by fucking, uh... Like, you know, metal bands, doesn't mean, like, you're a metal god. I mean, like, metal, like, bands and will have plenty of influences. The Locust Queen's down here. Fucking what is he at? And quiet. Oh man, come on, man. How could I resist that? Same team, split up. It's call him comedy, Marcus, but yeah. Also, he has metal guitars. There's not really such thing as a metal guitar. It's a matter of what kind of guitar you got and have you use your tuning and distortion. Like like plenty of metal bands have influences that are not from like non-metal bands. Bands. And like Mo Motorhead's a good example. They like rock and roll, like the Rolling Stones, and like punk rock, like the Ramones. Was, that helped influence their sound. Pantera, they love, you know, southern, like, you know, southern rock, okay? They love like ZZ Top and Pop and Leonard Skinner and all that stuff. We can use some Let's get him some support over there. Oh, what? Are you fucking kidding me, bruh? How the fuck? No, whatever. I'm gonna go on left side. I mean, any... Like, rock music now is just so... Far removed from what it once was. So it just doesn't even sound like what it is anymore. It doesn't really matter anyway. Let's get him some support over there. Oh, 
Alright, get him, Cole. If Cock Rock could become a thing where you can play your cock and a guitar, then that would be the super duper death of Rog. I mean, that's already existed just from a, you know, lyrical sense called, you know, hair metal and all that. But, eh. If you're talking about literal, yeah, no. It'd probably be a funny stunt devil thing and then just get ridiculed and then just people move on from it because that's just kind of how most things are in the world. Yeah, where is it? Oh, there you are. No, that's fucking griff. Nope. Fuck that shit, my ugh. I let it fart out. Oh, an hour and a half? Should be almost done this whole act. I think it should be like, what? Once, all I have to do is basically go through this fucking palace, do some shit, and then like, we should be like, good. Once we escape out the hive, I'm gonna call it a part, and then we'll do like, part five uh, next week to end this series off. Do you like six feet under? Not really. I mean, it's kind of for obvious reason. They literally just sound like a death metal parody. I don't know, like... They sound like... Well, literally. I mean, for fuck's sakes. Their vocalist is one of the first ever death metal vocalists, and he was... The death metal vocalist, really. He's the stereotype. Chris Barnes has literally made death metal the stereotype that what it is. Because of what Jim Carrey did on Ace Ventura Peck Detective. Like, we have... We have the stereotype of death metal that we see. Yeah, apparently Chris Barnes isn't the best guy. I don't, I don't really keep, keep attention to that type of shit. Because, you know, to be honest, I'm not into Cannibal Corpse and all that, so... Mm. Oh, well, it's understandable. I don't really like Cannibal Corpse in general. Like, I respect the talent that they have as a band. It's just the whole brutal, like, go, 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 go. like that shit just gets really samey, really boring, and really quick. Honestly, like, it's cool for like a few songs here and there, but once you were like, like after you hear it for like the tenth fucking time, it's like. It just grates on you. Exactly, Streetland Skulls. There, that's a repeti- God damn! Oh, fuck the uh, Great. Cannibal Corpse got me killed. Now I'm gonna start all the way fucking back. God, help me. Ugh! I'm gonna start all the way- oh, Great, there's no checkpoints. Ugh, whatever. <sighs> Fuck. I shouldn't, shouldn't expect much. Uh. We can use some cover over here. Let's get him some. Fuck, I just. Who's next? You're getting a little too happy. You know what's funny about death metal bands like Cannibal Corpse and all that? You can't even understand what the fuck they're saying half the time. If at all. Which I know it's death metal, you're not supposed to understand it. But it's like, it's kind of funny. Ugh.
Finally, a different viewer comes in. Bully tickers. Hashtag bully tickers. No, I am not dying today. Nick Tard. What's up, poop? Deep. Quite the entrance he had to make. Be mindful of your surroundings. Gotta kill some motherfuckers. Nick Tar. <laughs> it's racist, but you know what? I love racist humor. It, racial racial humor is great, and I, and I hope that never dies out. Oh, yeah. Like I understand you shouldn't like you know show that to children and shit like those old Bugs Bunny cartoons were back in the day. But like let let my fucking grown-ups have their like racial humor. It's great entertainment. And the reason why this SJW culture sucks because they won't let us do like racial fucking uh fucking like edge lord like you know gay humor. Metalheads love concerts. Well, yeah, that's kind of the whole point. I mean, like, I never hear much of a fan base side with the live concert experience as much as like metal bands do. It's like, it's like one of the things they absolutely love more than like much of anything. Even if they're not a fan of the music, they're like their live show's great. That's all you really need. As long as you have a good live show, you can like build off a career of mediocre music and not really do great in the studio. Uh, almost done. Now we're getting the help. Do you like the YouTuber Rocked? I like his content, but I feel like he has to, but I feel like he infuses his like leftist politics too much and is and, and, and arbitrarily gives us some reasons why he likes or dislikes someone like Foo Fighters. He likes him because, like, oh, he does, they do well for the community by, you know, endorsing uh, Barack Obama and Joe Biden or something. While disliking, you know, Kid Rock because, you know, he's a right winger or some shit. Like, doing similar shit for Donald Trump and shit. My friend follows him. Which friend? I don't know, he's a good channel. He makes good content when he's not talking politics. I mean, he's just talking about just reviewing the album, or grading the past, that type of shit. He does a lot of good content, but the politics can get annoying sometimes. Fuck! <laughs> almost died. It's not like a deal breaker, but it's like, I don't know, I find it a little annoying. I mean, just look at the white, like, just look at the gatekeeping video. He even had infused white supremacists of problems. Like, no, not really. Oh, real life friends? Lucky you. I don't know, I don't think he's a bad guy, I just think he has a little faults about infusing shit when they shouldn't be. Rock feud. Ooh. I mean, no shit. And it's led people to literally just fall for stuff that's not even true, but whatever. Okay, this is it. Finally, we're Bottom almost floor, sporting goods, lingerie, and one bitch ass queen. <laughs> Oh great, that thing just had to open up, didn't it? Gotta be a whack rock! Uh, you guys should get this. He also is a tool fanboys. I mean I know he likes tool and I know he likes rage against the machine, which that's understandable. But still, he usually he has mostly good takes. It's just every now and again he has a bad take on music, like like pro Lincoln Park, like that stuff cringe. But like that's only like one band, like so what? Just 
as long as you have good content and you just deliver on that front, I don't really give a fuck really too bad what your politics are. Well, he likes all forms of rock music. I mean, he's called Rocked. He's gonna cover all forms of rock music. Whether it be pop punk, new metal, death metal, prog, you know, everything. Everything's gonna get covered on the Rock YouTube channel. At the barriers. Yep. <laughs> I don't like Lincoln Park. They suck ass. They sound like he's whining. Like, they just sound like an M. You took M. Shadow's like you know regular singing voice, but put it on the scream levels. And it just sounds bad. I've I'm pretty sure he hates all the one undead because of like the tryhard edgy like you no know, bullshit in fact they weren't that good. I doubt it's because of the like they're not woke. I mean Hollywood Undead are just like they're literal frat boys. I mean come on. I don't even like Hollywood Undead because they're just stupid. No one likes Maroon 5 unless you're literally a pop fucking listener. Like, no one here likes fucking Maroon 5. Like, anyone with any slight mu critical music thinking skills hates Maroon 5. I mean, so would I. No, no one wants to listen to Maroon 5 because Maroon 5 is fucking trash. Oh. It's all done. Uh. Hey, Killgas said, Did you see that Lowry had a meltdown over a country singer over to the Bud Life stuff? Not even a rock singer? No, I don't really keep up with Lowry. Did they really? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, that does sound like something they would normally do. Well, let's hope she's home. Could be a trap. Stay alert. <laughs> it's a trap, all right. Shit. Just run. <laughs> uh, I'm, like, I'm good. I don't know. I don't fucking know these fucking like country singers. I don't really give a shit. It's like. Bud Light, like, it's such a non-issue controversy. It's like, it's the equivalent of Velma. And thankfully, conservatives are doing the right thing. It's just like, the reaction is cringe. Alright, now we get to go deal with the Queen. I wonder if that fucking Scorch fucker is going to be there. No, I'm just kidding. Oh boy.
You're the first humans to ever desecrate this palace with your presence. It's her. And I assure you, you will most certainly be the last. That's the Locust Queen? I thought she was supposed to be brought up here. If you're planning on flooding the Hollow, then I guess we would be the last. Yes. Though you destroyed the Riftworm, there are still ways for us to sink Jacinta. You will perish along with the Lambert. Not if we sink it first. <laughs> Scourge informed me of your plan to sink Jacinto before us. I'm afraid it won't work. Don't be so sure. Oh, but I am. We already have an army en route to Jacinto to prevent that from happening. Tell me, is it true? You're the son of Adam Phoenix. What's it to you? He spoke highly of you. It's a shame that you didn't follow his path. The hell are you talking about? It no longer matters. Scourge, destroy them. Have you thought about doing a reaction with no face cam? Maybe. Uh-huh. <laughs> Fuck off, bitch. I'm surprised Ty had a hard time with this. You know, it is humorous that... Dom, I need some help with those tickers! Oh wow, they just automatically give me this shit. But yeah, I never really th I might do reaction vids, like, I don't know, like, streams. Watch the select type. Oh! Again, I must say, I don't know how Ty had a problem with this guy. He doesn't have the strategy. Do you like the punk card NBA? He's the only liberal rock channel that has no problem with conservatives. Well, yeah, his fucking wife is like a full-on conservative. Like, if, if you watch her channel, I, I did check out her videos. I was just curious, like, what, what? Punk punk or NBA has a wife and does videos? And she's... Like, full on, like, his Asian wife is like full on red, well, I wouldn't say red pill, but definitely very conservative leaning. Like, who's full on anti woke and everything. It's actually impressive. I don't. But he's not a full on lip cuck anyway, he's like a moderate liberal. Boss fight. Too easy. I wish it lasted longer. Shit, where'd he go? I mean, fucking with Punk Rock NBA, I mean, the biggest problem with him is his little inconsistencies. Like, he'll hate slam, Russian slam metal because sexism, lol, and he'll go full of metal elitist when it's, like, for slam metal, when it's not a certain way, yet he will criticize metal elitists, and yet his little love for trap metal is very cringe, I'm not gonna lie, very cringe. 
But uh, he's he's a good channel. I'm I'm grateful that he has the success. He deserves that almost anyone. So I'll. She escaped on a river. Which way'd she go? Forget the queen. We need to find a way back. So I'm not gonna complain. Well, there are two more reavers back there. Worth the shot. Move out. He praised the animal. Because your Canadian leg, like, I, I am one to mention Let's that this ape became cool to love the blue chain of raptors when it turned to succeed in the late 2010s. Reeves. Keep moving. Yeah, it's pretty cringe. I'm not gonna lie. Just keep running. Keep Fuck you. There's our ticket out of here. Yeah, they give me a lot of dicks, but there's some Marcus, cool ones. I don't think they're gonna let us just climb on them. You got a better idea? Let's ride, Delta. Do you guys have Canadian dry AK ginger? I think we have some like ginger fucking whatever. I don't drink that shit, cause that's garbage. It's a flying one. It ain't cool, but let's just get the fuck out of here. Let's go. Horsey horsey. Like the raptors and the blue jays have been crap anyway. Let's get to Jacinto, after uh, aftermath. Okay, no, that's it. We're not. Alrighty, I think we're gonna call this a part. I didn't realize when it was gonna end. You like baseball? No, fuck baseball. It's boring as shit. Anyway, I'm gonna call this a part next week, probably next Tuesday or some shit. I'm probably gonna stream. It will be the last part, part five. This particular one should be out by Wednesday or when the fuck it comes out. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this stream. What time? Probably the same time as always. It's around 7 to 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm so, uh, keep an eye out for those streams when that happens. So, uh, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video. Take care, and of course, God bless you all.